Hi, my name is Armin Asadi. I was originally born in the Islamic Republic of Iran. Currently, I live in St. Paul, Minnesota. My name is Kelly Brown. I'm from Robbinsdale, Minnesota. My name is Peter Lamberts. I'm from Brooklyn Park, Minnesota. I'm Dan Tolley from Northeast Minneapolis. I'm Bob Rampy, and I'm from Brooklyn Center, Minnesota. I'm Scott Stieskel. I live in Northeast Minneapolis. I'm Eric Storr from Apple Valley, Minnesota. Before I met in the city, my life was a mess. I was lost. I was angry. In fact, at some points, I was suicidal. I felt hopeless. I didn't really know what my future was going to look like, regardless of what I was coming out of. Being lonely was not, not what I was looking for. It was not enjoyable. Life uh, was a lot less uh, meaningful. Prior to coming to Men of the City, I was isolated, and I did not want to talk about my past. My life was miserable. It was really painful. My life at that time felt very alone, and dealing with problems by myself instead of with a group of men. I felt kind of, you know, just, like I didn't have any, like, family or anything, you know, like, no companionship. I was so afraid of the future that I hid in my parents' basement. I didn't do anything. I couldn't keep a job. I couldn't meet a girl. I couldn't do any of the things that were supposed to bring you into adulthood because I was just too terrified. At the end of it all, I just felt alone. I felt alone. Men of the City uh, has impacted me. Uh, it's given me a lot of friendships. It's given me a lot of uh, fun experiences and a lot of opportunities just to be myself. It's completely changed me. It's completely transformed me. I went from hardened criminal to full-time ministry at a church. I've experienced a genuine relationship. I've, I've experienced uh, doing life with, with other men, and uh, it was something I didn't have in my life before. Men in the City has helped me change to love people in plain sight. It's all about just having confidence and hope in it. It's about wanting to take control of life instead of just letting it happen to you. You don't fear it anymore, you just kind of go out and grab it. I have made many lifelong connections with men of men in the city. I have entered people's lives and they have entered my life in unique ways. And it's been very beneficial to me doing life with other men. Having male friends here at Men of the City has changed the way I deal with my life entirely. I used to isolate myself big time because I thought the problems I've had were uh, very unique and found out that they are not all the guys sharing the same type of problems. My name is Patrick Lamberts and I started Men of the City in 2006. And it really came out of a desire to just change the way I was living my life. I found a few good guys at my local church and we talked about starting up an accountability group. We didn't call it an accountability group, but we got together on a weekly basis. We'd have pizza, we'd go to the hot tub, and we would just share life struggles with each other. And we incorporated some Bible study and it really started to change our life. After a while, we, our lifestyles started to change very dramatically. And in a short nine months, each of our lifestyles were dramatically different than when we first met. And that's really the heartbeat of the foundation of Men of the City. We want guys who come to Men of the City to experience transformation we want them to experience a place where they are welcome, a place where they can come and sharpen, where they can get real and authentic with each other, but moreover, feel empowered that when they leave and go to their daily lives, that they have something significant that they can work towards. Hey everyone, my name is Nathan, and I'm one of the leaders here at Men of the City. It's all about relationships. And we're looking for you to help make Men of the City better than ever. You can get involved by checking us out at menofthecity.net. Please consider giving generously and becoming
becoming a long-term partner with us. Together, we can make a difference and impact the lives of so many, one man at a time. Thank you.